the son of a Mississippi Hill Country sharecropper, Robert Belfour rose from rural obscurity to become an internationally acclaimed bluesman. But it didn't happen overnight. Sitting at the knee of his father, Grant, young Robert picked up the distinctive Mississippi Hill Country blues guitar style and made it his own. There was little work for traditional blues artists, and Belfour had a family to support. He spent the next 35 years laboring in concrete construction, with his music getting an occasional hearing at a house party or a hole-in-the-wall club. With the renaissance of Bill Street, the sound of the blues again echoed through downtown Memphis, and quite often that sound came from Robert Belfour, where he performed in open parks and along sidewalks, playing for himself and for tips. By 1990, Robert Belfour had blossomed into a revered, legendary performer in Memphis circles, but was largely unknown elsewhere. In 1993, that all changed when he was invited to play for audiences in Germany, quickly followed by an appearance in a 1994 documentary film by blues scholar David Evans. Suddenly, Belfour was in demand all over the world, to date, he has performed at major blues festivals throughout the United States, Europe, Latin America, and Australia, and has released three CDs since 2000. At the age of 68, this former concrete construction worker is now an acclaimed ambassador for Memphis's musical heritage, and many consider Robert Belfour to be America's best living country blues performer.